All right, so out of the packet challenge lock from Priest in Australia to get to. So let's uh, see what we got. Into that. Comes in a box. Looks like we can pass down there. Sort of. Hopefully that box isn't important and it's just packaging. <coughs> sure it is. All right, got some packing material. Oh, if I am having trouble, hints inside. Let's put that over there. All right, nice mummified key in a balloon. <laughs> Another note, this one say, so. don't need to shim it, I'll need some deep hooks, beware of oversets. All right. So here is the face of this. So you see we've got a, a BD Lockwood restricted core in a Lockwood oval format. Got that cam piece on the back, which means Taking these soft jaws out of the vice, put those out of the way, which means not getting that cam piece stuck. So I'll mount it quite high. All right, more, more like that. Ideally, with a key, I could test that, but whatever. Um, deep hook, we reckon. Yeah. Um, I've got a fairly open key lane. Oops. Yeah. Oh, yeah, good. We've had to go all the way from the bottom. Oh, uh, do you need to do the tin? Yeah. All right. So, point four, and we can try and deforest us off the ledge, see how that goes for a start. Um, multi pick up the top. I need one slightly thinner that doesn't quite fit. It's trouble with doing one out of the packet, you don't have anything prepared. Let's try the number 12. Um, yeah, all right, that'll do. It's a little bit loose, but yeah, let us start picking. Oh, got it. <clears throat> Might have been an epic journey, but we got it on the first go. Yeah. <sighs> well done, Priest. I don't know what's stuck in there, but... 
but we're definitely going to have to zoom through a bunch of that. Full concentration. My hands are a little bit sore, a little bit sweaty. Whew. All right. No hints were required. Thank you, though. All right. Oof. All right. Let's get the bias out of the way. Screws out. Yeah. No shimmy says. All right, so. We can see, without having used the key, there's the bidding. So quite a lot of pin action on most of these needed. One, two, three, four, five, six. Right, so let's get um, some tweezers. Not those ones. All right, so no modifications to the key pins. That did say beware of oversets, but you know, they're all just standard, so there's nothing to actually trap you in one. Um, two, three, four, five, six. No mods to the Cool. All right. Let's see what we got. One. Lockwood spool. Spring. Two. Multi-step, deep serrated. Deep, single serration. It's annoying with giant slugs, so you really need to be careful to get the spring out every time. Let's see, we've got spring variation, which is Nice. Another serrated spool thing. Standard on five. And huh. that did not feel like that's what it had in it. There's nothing wild or exotic in there at all. Um, which is a real surprise because I swear they put up more fight than these pins suggest it should, which means I'm probably gonna put this back together and give it another quick pick um, and see if I can't improve that time because really, it should have been a lot easier than that. Uh, better look at this key as well. So here we have nice key. Lockwood RBD. Which obviously fits in there. Can't see any reason why that key wouldn't work nicely. Let's just stick those pins in as well. Yep. Alright, 
There we go. Well, that was uh, a possibly unnamed challenge log by a priest. Um, I will have to hassle him and tell him to give it a name. But there we go. All right, I've just noticed something while playing with this. So this may have contributed to why it felt weird. Pin two here, it doesn't, it's quite a deep hole, but it only just goes in a tiny bit. So it's like an anti-bump pin. I'm not sure if that's intentional or not. Uh, maybe you just never try putting it in the plug. Obviously it fits in the chambers at the top. It's possible those are very slightly wider. But it just it doesn't really come down into the the chamber or any. So it doesn't do it in any of the positions. So yes, that's why that might have felt loose, is that it doesn't actually go down all the way. Um same for three. It doesn't doesn't really go in properly. And this one doesn't really go in properly. So I suspect that one, two, and three of those in two, three, and four, not really going into the chamber all the way, uh, made a big impact into what was not being set. Reassembled. Bidding wasn't that extreme, so we're just going to use the uh, deep forest here. Cut to two. Five. One. There you go. Easy. Actually, some of those pins didn't even need to be set. So that's the thing with challenge locks. You don't know what's in there. It makes it a heck of a lot harder. Once you've seen those pins, actually pretty easy. I suspect that that may not have been built quite that way intentionally. Um, but there we go. Um, that is Priest's challenge lock. Thoroughly defeated. That took a long time.